Hi everybody, it's the Retro Yuki once again. Special talk for you guys today for October the 2nd, 2021. Welcome to a special edition of Retro Yuki Roundup. As we prepare for October, scary games coming. The, the, the Halloween customs are alive, but I do want to give you guys a look, a brief look into what, what is the future of Retro Yuki Gaming. I'm going to be showing you guys what's coming to this channel in a presentation Word document. And I'm going to tell you guys what's coming up today. So for today, we have VR chat with our buddy GamerJVA at 5.15, 5.15 sharp. And 9.15, we're going to have Maple Story for you guys. However, the main focus of today is what's coming up for Retro Yuki Gaming. And today, for that, I would like to show you guys my YouTube channels. I have four to show you guys. So let's take a look at what we have for you guys today. So what we have looking at here, I'm going to show you my fa my favorite tool, the notepad, in just a moment. But what I have here is a Super Mario World ROM hack that I am making. That's one of the things that's coming up for the channel starting next week. So I made this in Lunar Magic for you guys. So this is Super Mario World ROM hack. So Super Mario World. Um, let's like a Mario Maker for Super Mario World. And the software I use is called Lunar Magic, and I'm going to be bringing that to the main channel as tutorials and all that good stuff. Ignore the level names. I'm still learning how to use it. That's why. So you, have, you make your own Super Mario World level and level collections and all that cool stuff. And I'm so excited to tell you guys I'm bringing it to the main channel. After it's been on the sub channel for a while. I am still going to post to this channel, but most of the content will be starting on the main channel as well. So the other one that I did... There is an actual one right here, the Mario and Luigi Cola Kingdom. This is a pretty cool one. It has a customized HUD and a customized um, thingamajiggy here. Ignore the the discords because I have a new one for the gaming one. The anime one works because that's the one I've been using. So things like this are coming to the main channel. And then our level collections are still there. I'm going to remove these because I'm going to go back to Super Mario World ROM hacks. Another thing that's coming to the main channel, game development material. So game development material is coming back. I like how my channel ratio is 150. So basically it's 50-50. <laughs> I like that, but it's not, not good for the YouTube algorithm. Because I know I get noise complaints on this channel. But remember... When I was still starting out RPG Maker material, yeah, I wasn't that good at editing. Now I got better. So I got better at something. Okay, anyway. So I've been developing a game and I've been hiding this because of the fact that it's a game development and not gaming. But because of the word game, I better start putting it on the main channel because it's gaming. So, so take a look at this here. Brand new material coming to the main channel. This is behind the scenes of how I'm developing my game, by the way. And the recent video was one year ago. So you get all this cool stuff. And I actually did one live for you guys. That is how the thing works. How the thing stuff works. So I have... I have the HUD screen, the ammo tracker, which has weapons now. 
the prayer hall, dungeon shop, saving crystals, fast travel, and a battle changes returns to a turn based system, skill levels, enemy levels, skill boards, and skill points. And the the development the build is already up, by the way, the demo. If you guys want that, let me know. All right. But all this stuff will be moving over to the main channel. And then the demo gameplay begins. Okay. Now, tutorials, I'm going to be very careful with these. The only reason why it's 50% is because of noise. I'm going to warn you it's noise. I think it's more of noise and stuff. Or because it might be too long. We'll see. 30 minutes? Uh, yeah, that's too long. Yeah, this is too long. Yeah, 21 minutes. Yeah, that's too long. And I think I did this live too. But this was a lesson on variables and how they work. I'm going to try to shorten this out when I move it over to the main channel. So, that's just a taste of what's coming up to the main channel. And because of that, here's how the main channel looks now. I changed it to groups of playlists and all that good stuff. So that's how it looks. That's how it looks from now on. All right. Now, let's go over the presentation part. Go over the presentation portion. And to do that, I would like to invite you to welcome my friend, my new friend, the notepad. Or I should say Microsoft Word. My new friend, Microsoft Word. And I have pr provided for you guys a presentation. So, the, the, the purpose of this talk is to present to you guys changes, concerns, and additions that are going to be coming to the season. And the, and all, everything you're about to learn is coming up starting today and all, all the way to November 31st, at least until November 31st. Okay, the report will outline changes to the schedule, additional content, merging of content, removal of channels, game development content on the main channel, Super Mario World ROM hacks on the main channel, discussion of pre winter 2021 season plans, and so much more. So here's the progress report so far. So all you have been seeing are the addition of the split gate montages, level collection, VR chat, and the form of open lobbies, and the roundup shows that I do like this one, and VR chat highlights as well. Video progress. Most of them are up and running. Some of them are behind, but I'm still working on those. And that's only because of the changes. Live streaming. Most of the time, you've been seeing me live stream on Fridays and Saturdays with occasional Thursdays. However, starting in the second half, starting today, Thursdays is a live streaming day, and I'm going to show you how we're going to do that. New content from the first half includes split game montages, VR chat previews, VR chat open lobbies, and new games like Little Nightmares. Our Content schedule as of right now. Our content days are Monday to Wednesdays, including Sundays. Video types include those the highlight videos, montages, and all that good stuff. On streaming days, we have Thursday nights, Friday, and Saturday. Thursday being random, Friday being VR chat and selected game. Saturday nights are our selected game. VR chat if needed. And right now, today, it's needed because... My buddy has scheduled a VR chat with us today. 
at 5.15. So we are doing, we are attending that. We're going to accommodate today. Upcoming changes and in plans include game development material, as I mentioned um, a few moments ago. Indie game live plays or recorded let's plays on, we'll see, I'm going to give you the official schedule for days. Game development progress when needed, VR chat series episodes, which will begin in two weeks. Super Mario World RAM hacks will be returning. RPG Maker MV tutorials will be starting, will be returning. Maple Story will have its day on Thursday, not Sunday. And then here are the changes. The merging of the game development material, so the original development channel will be removed after the merge. And new sections will be added to the channel for game development. Playlists for game development progress will also be included. And then we have the Super Mario World ROM hacks. So I'm going to remove the original channel of the Super Mario World ROM hack. And then I'm going to make a playlist group for you guys to be made on the main channel for demos and full ROM hacks. It allows me to better promote these games because some of these are so good that I think you might want to play again. And then I'm going to add a playlist to include a Lunar Magic tutorial series, which allows me to teach you guys how to make these stuff, even for beginners. Uh, my first ROM hack, by the way, I am making one, will be released very late 2021, and I will be streaming these for the fall and, see, and, fall and winter. So that 80% is now 100. Now, Starting next week, we have a brand new content schedule, and starting today, we have a brand new content schedule. Just for today, I am making Maple Story on Saturday, but that's only because I want to take a break from Splitgate. That's it. However, I want to give you guys this note: on VR Chat, it's open lobby any day, any Friday. However, there's an exception. The exception to the rule is if there is a series we are recording, we are recording an episode. I will tell you guys now that episode one script is done, meaning we are ready to go to record. This is me and my buddy have to sit down, record lines, that's it. Then we are doing, we're ready, we're, ju we're juicy. Okay? So on those days that we are recording for this series, no VR chat open lobby, instead those are private. However, in lieu of that, I am open to a live stream at 10.30, at 10 o'clock instead of 9.15. Just to, just to give you guys something, okay? So we are late. We are going to play into the night in a way. Just to give you guys a makeup, okay, for that one day. Because I want to be transparent with you guys. I don't want to start missing streams just because... I want to start doing this for real now. So, with that being said, Monday to Wednesday, off-stream content is going to stay the same. I'm not going to change anything about Monday to Wednesday. Thursday is a brand new thing. MMO Thursday. So, no more random games. No more random games on Thursdays. We're doing Maple Story and New World. New World has a caveat where I have to log in early because of the queue. However, right now, because yesterday, I was queuing in for the 915 show. I was at 674 people in front of me. An hour later, it was like something else. You know what I mean? So, yeah, I had to be very careful with those. With the VR chat, I mean with the... With the um, New World. Friday is the same. Friday, we're going to have the morning reactions with TV artists that are peace and one other channel. I just picked up a channel yesterday to react to, so you're going to get that. And then we're going to include our VR chat and selected game and then the live selected game at 9.15. Saturday is going to be our indie game, Saturday. So anything made in RPG Maker MV will be starting on Saturday. If you have RPG Maker VX Ace, that will be also accepted. RPG Maker VX will also be accepted and XP 
will be accepted and we'll be starting those 515 and 915 regular times on Saturdays. Sundays, anything goes. Like wild card. And then the winter season. The winter season begins December 13, 2021. And for the most part, the content from the fall will say the same. Our Maple Story becomes a season game, so it becomes a game of rota rotation to a season game. And our streaming days in the fall and the winter are Mondays, Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturdays, with our content days being Tuesdays, Thursdays, Wednesdays, and Sundays. Our teams, we have teams for the season. For the winter, on Mondays, we're going to have Maple Mondays, meaning Maple Story. Tuesdays, Thursdays, we're going to have Mario Hacks as Thursdays. Basically, Super Mario World ROM Hacks. Fridays, we're going to have VR Chat and Open Lobby Games. So, Splitgate. Um, Splitgate, VR Chat is another option. Um, and any other games that have an open lobby to them. Saturdays are Indie Saturdays. What about tutorials, you ask? Tutorials will also be on Sundays. Will be on Sundays. So content day, content days. We're gonna have Tuesdays and Wednesdays and Sundays. The so Tuesdays we're gonna do the VR chat highlights and Maple Story. Wednesdays we're gonna be doing indie games and Mario ROM hacks. And Sundays we're gonna be doing the RPG Maker tutorials, um, game development updates, and so on. We're also going to be doing tutorials for other stuff like the Moody Bots. And finally, what be, what's beyond the winter season? Beyond the winter season 2021, we have our first VR chat series will be finished in 2022. Hopefully. Okay, we'll see what happens with this. Monetization for the YouTube channel will begin in 2022. I re... I am 100% confident it's going to be 2022. I am 40% confident it's 2021. The only reason why is because we are at 682 subs. We need 1,000. We're getting close. But we'll see what happens, okay? If we can get to 750 by October 25th, I'm just saying there is a... I'm going to increase the odds to 54 percent and i i just chose october 25th because that's my birthday that's it other than that that just picked up that picked that number out of the hat okay so i will include a third part third party merch store starting in 2022 and emotes will be coming once monetization is included so francis the fox emotes oh yeah I know you like those retro inspired emotes and so on. Also, speaking of YouTube memberships, I am working on a plan right now on what I'm going to include, what I'm going to offer. I, I did a video a few days ago talking about what could be offered. Okay, now here's another option Patreon. Here's the catch, the Patreon. Patreon and YouTube does have something in common. They have a live stream service. Here's the catch. If you, I'm doing this on Patreon, it's exclusive to Patreon. Because they can actually do a live stream for Patreon supporters. However, I don't want to be that exclusive yet. No, sir. What I'm thinking of doing is this. If you are a member, if you are a page, if you are a YouTube member, there is a bot that allows me to make a poll, uh, a role for you in my Discord server. If you are a member of my Discord server and you are a member of YouTube, like the join button, then you get a perk in my Discord server. If you get that perk, I mean that role, and you are a YouTube member. You get something special. You get bonus access to a channel where you can watch me live stream Discord game, Discord day on a game. And you get to participate by using a special chat. 
Okay, I'm going to work this out first though because this is a new thing. Okay, I want to see where where we are at that point. So that's why I'm not releasing it yet. I will tell you I am going to beta test this this, this particular thing very soon. I want to see where it goes before I make this a possible perk because if I do this incorrectly then we're gonna have problems with other stuff and I don't want that to happen especially as we get close to 1000 subscribers okay so right now it's the beta test round once we get to 950 subscribers then I'm going to really look into perks and stuff for you guys but until then all of this is speculation or i should say predictions okay now what else do i need to talk about well besides the cool stuff that i just showed you and the upcoming material well maple story i'm going to talk a little bit of maple story here now the way i'm going to talk about maple story is this go back to my face cam here there we go. So Maple Story. For Maple Story, I want to talk to you guys about something interesting. Something special is coming. There's a brand new class in Maple Story. I forgot what it's called. I just did the uh, play there yesterday. But um there's a new thing I want to try out for Maple Story. Monta um sabotage. But I'm gonna do it very in more interesting. This is way beyond the Shadow of the Hedgehog sabotage because it's just a story. But this is a game. This is an MMO. And for Maple Story, the sabotages are going to be very different. So, for example, every episode of Maple Story, we're going to have a, a sabotage. The only ones that are going to have a one time use are the class. And and that's it. I think the class is the only one that's going to be sabotaged one time. So for example, um, we spin a wheel, and the wheel ends up being I'm going to be a I'm going to be an Adele class, or let's say I'm going to be a a explorer, but I'm bowman, or uh, an explorer and a um. What's that word? Magician. So anything in that particular case is only one time because you cannot change your class in Maple Story after you selected one, at least from my understanding. Okay? But uh, there's another sabotage we can do within the sabotage. And that is we can spin the wheel to determine that I be, am I able to use potions how many skills am I allowed? How many potions am I allowed for that stream? So each stream is going to be different in a way. So it's going to be a lot more fun than just me grinding out like 500 levels or whatever in one stream. Like I want to make it fun. I want to make it interesting. So that's all I have to say about the uh, Maple Story of Sabotage. For tonight, Maple story, I'm just gonna take it slow. Take it easy. Okay. We'll see how easy it's gonna get, okay? But for now we'll see you guys in about 515 for our VR chat session. If it's cancelled, it's gonna be Maple Story. But for now, we'll see you guys soon, y'all.